alaikum friends hope sure you all good this is Saeed Khan uh, in this video I'm gonna show you uh, how we uh, easily understand about how we can easily understand about the panel data uh, what are different panel data types different panel data models and how we can run a random effect model fixed effect model with the help of this data so guys uh, uh, first of all I would like to share with you I have a few materials about the panel data as uh, I have total five pages so it's not easy for me to speak out here all the material so I would like to suggest you please just read the material and here you can see different definitions about the panel data and here you can see uh, different uh, benefits of using panel data and here you can see a uh, different uh, characteristics of panel data here are different types uh, like a short panel long panel and both and now you also can see panel data models like pooled model and uh, the descriptions about the pool model and uh, here fixed effect model and now random effect model uh, sorry guys uh, you have to read yourself here you can see fixed effect model or a random effect model means uh, I have a comparison further uh, here you can see how to choose between a random effect model or fixed effect model but guys uh, I would like to suggest you use a houseman test on the base of the houseman test you can easily choose between the random effect model or the fixed effect model so here you can see uh, reference if you want to give the reference in your paper or uh, in your thesis and then uh, maybe your supervisor can say how you can prove that the houseman test is, is can be used uh, to choose between a random effect or the fixed effect model as uh, i have been taken this screenshot from the uh, uh, basic econometric fourth edition uh, gujarati and you can give this reference so friends uh, now i'm um, doing a uh, practically uh, how we can run a uh, random effect or the a fixed effect model and uh, further how we can run the houseman test go to file open as I have my data here I have my data so yes you can see here I have a data uh, years company means I want to analyze uh, different companies data now my variables ENVC EPS ROA ROE ROC so guys and uh, to run the panel data first of all we must give a specific code to each cross section like if we have Unilever and uh, my first company uh, suppose you may have may have your country but I want to mm, analyze uh, companies data so uh, to run uh, these data we must uh, give some code to uh, like uh, mm, I may assign one one uh, Unilever company uh, two two for the FFC uh, three three for the Honda so the first step is to assign specific code so I don't like to give manually so uh, I'll give a command to uh, I will give, uh, give a command to Stata Stata um, automatically uh, assign the code all the cross sections so what is command you can see here uh, to give the command all cross sections as um, I have company's data so I should run this command look here e gen company 1 is equal to group and bracket then company bracket close ok so now I have assigned the code of all uh, cross sections like again I'm going in my data you can see here uh, for the Unilever uh, stata automatically assigned 99 and for the FFC stata assigned 111 and for the Honda uh, stata assigned 333 so my first step complete now uh, I must set the time 
uh, as I have my annual data so for the annual data I must run this command look here as I have done uh, X T set company one years comma yearly because I have yearly data enters and now you can see I have unbalanced data from 2007 to 2013 hey guys from uh, before random effect or the fix, fix effect if you want to see the summary of your data you can uh, run this type uh, this command xt sum uh, envc eps roa ro means you have to write your all variables names and enter you can see the overall summary uh, of all your variables in which you have mean standard deviation uh, minimum values and maximum values now i want to run the stata so what is command for the stata so i have this command for the fixed effect model so i think strata is most easiest way to run fixed effect model so guys st rec xt rec envc eps roa roe comma fe you must write first your dependent variable then all your independent variable then comma then fe fe represent for the fixed effect and enter and you can see here in this box i have my dependent variable and here i have my all independent variable here i have probability values you can see my first variable is eps probability values more than five percent means indicating that there is a no significant or uh, statistically significant effect or relationship between E and VC and EPS but for the return on asset uh, my probability value is less than 5% so I can say there is a significant plus coefficient value is in uh, positive so I can say there is a positive and significant association among return on asset and E and VC so for the return on equity you can see here guys my probability value is less than 5% means there is a significant association but uh, look here on the coefficient value coefficient value is a uh, negative so I can say there is a negative and significant association among return on equity and ENVC so guys uh, after running the fixed effect model I must uh, store the uh, output for uh, store output write this command estimate store fixed effect fe so i have stored because i want to run the houseman test so uh, to running houseman test i must store my outputs so now i have been applied uh, random effect model now i want to apply uh, sorry i have been applied a uh, fixed effect model now i want to run random effect model here For the random effect model, uh, same uh, command is like a fixed effect model xtrec, xtrec envc, envc again my dependent variable then my all independent variable comma and uh, in the above uh, output I wrote fe but now for the random effect I must write comma re, here you can see and enter you can see the results of the random effect model and from the probability value I can see there is a no statistically uh, significant relationship among independent variable and dependent variable because of probability value is more than 5% I must uh, store the results of the random effect estimate store re I done here enter now my both results are stored now in the memory uh, random effect plus uh, fix, uh, fix effect model now I want to run the houseman test as I have been told you houseman test can be applied to choose between random effect model or the 
or you can say uh, random effect or the fixed effect model here uh, friends you can see what is guideline about the selection of uh, appropriate model note if you don't uh, sorry here null hypothesis random effect is appropriate alternative fixed effect is appropriate so here so guys uh, what is guideline uh, between choosing uh, random effect or the fixed effect model if the uh, we shall accept null hypothesis if the probability value of the houseman comes greater than the 5% means whenever you find a uh, probability value is more than 5% so you must go for the random effect model but uh, what if we have less than 5% uh, probability value in this case we should go for the fixed effect model so guys and now i'm going for houseman test uh, what is command for houseman test houseman test is this here you can see houseman fixed f e then space r e okay uh, look here probability value is less than 5% so what was guideline whenever you have probability value less than 5% fixed effect model is good so guys in this case you have fixed effect model better so uh, according to houseman test you must go for the fixed effect model as houseman test suggesting you go for the fixed effect model and uh, you should interpret results and you must include all the results of the uh, fixed effects model because uh, a random effect model is not appropriate for you on the base of the houseman test hey guys uh, i run all the tests uh, on the base of the commands what if you want to run uh, by click system i uh, suppose the first go to statics then uh, longitudinal panel data then setup utility then declare data set to be panels so guys uh, here uh, um, i want to give the codes uh, like uh, basically i have already done uh, codes with the help of the command but if you don't like uh, to giving code with the help of the command you must assign in your excel sheet by hand uh, suppose uh, you you have already done uh, your codes and now select here your codes uh, variables and here your times as i have my erdz data okay and now i have in select time and i assign the code uh, now i want to run the fixed effect model go to statics then uh, longitudinal panel data and then linear models then uh, linear regression select here fixed effect model and from here dependent variable e and c and then select your all independent variables yeah i done and okay uh, my fixed effect model now uh, now i want to restore here now you must store your uh, results statics post estimation from here manage estimation store then store in trying to estimate uh, you must give the name uh, like fixed effect okay now you uh, your fixed effect uh, results are save again here uh, longitudinal panel data linear model here and just uh, select random here now for random effect select here okay you can see your variables and again store results 
for store uh, here launch give the name like uh, name is random okay results are stored now and now I want to run house main test how I can give statics here post estimation here houseman click here right here fixed effect right here random effect and ok you can see again your probability value so guys thank you so much uh, hope sure you enjoyed uh, again thank you so much for being with me take care